What are the demands of leadership in producing change uh, that I think is difficult? Is you've got to be both strategic and tactical. Uh, President Kennedy, uh, when he said we're going to put people on the moon and bring them back safely within a decade, uh, certainly a strategic issue, but he, through the people who worked for him, uh, made sure that the uh, tactical follow-up was there and that uh, bolts weren't left off or engines left off the, uh, the spacecraft and, and the likes. And the, uh, there, I think, unfortunately, you've got to pay attention to the details. But if you don't have a grand vision, uh, people won't know where you're going. And ch producing change is one of the hardest tasks, I believe, of, of, of leadership or of management. Uh, a reason for that goes all the way back to a statement by Machiavelli, who said that, uh, uh, and I won't, I'm not quoting, but really the issue is that uh, uh, those who uh, are opposed to leadership, uh, are opposed to change, uh, usually feel very strongly about it and make themselves heard. And those who will be the beneficiary of change uh, don't have that great a stake in it and are usually pretty quiet. And so you have this disproportionate opposition to change. But if there's one thing I learned in my business career is that if you don't change, the people around you will change and you'll suffer from it. And uh, you have to constantly uh, even be destroying your own current business which is hard to do, uh, but if you, for example, if you were in the uh, film camera business, uh, you'd better recognize early on that uh, you better get in the digital camera business, uh, even if it meant destroying your own market, because if you didn't, somebody else would get there first and uh, be in the catbird seat. So change is a challenge. The other big lesson I learned about making change, which is counterintuitive, I think, uh, Many people argue that you should do it slowly, give people time to get used to the change, and don't do anything that's too disruptive. I found that that's just exactly wrong, that uh, if you're going to make big change, get, do it quickly, get it over with, and get on with life, uh, get into the new mode. Uh, people could stand change, they just can't stand uncertainty.